Earlier today, President Baros Motokid arrived at the Kimfad Mosque in Banjul for the Eid prayers. The president was flanked on either side by top government officials and security personnel. Among them, Vice President Mohamed Jalo. <laughs> The two Raka prayers was led by the Imam Ratib of Banjul, Imam Cherno Ali Umaska. In his preaching, messages of peace, love, and tolerance resonated. The Eid prayers climax with the slaughtering of the sacrificial ram by Imam Ratib, and then the message of goodwill by President Barrow. Gambia, we are, we are unique. We are a very peaceful country. I think there is nothing that should change that. We should continue on that unity, work together in the national, uh, in national interest. I think that is my message, but I congratulate everyone of, uh, every, every Gambian definitely on, the, on this very important occasion. The president used the occasion to call for unity among Gambians. Today is a day that we should all reconcile. As Gambians, we should be united. I've always been saying it. All the countries that have developed, they are all united. We want Gambians to be united, join my government, and we work together and move this country forward. I think that is the most important message for, 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 for Gambians. Unity is strength. Back to the State House, the President slaughtered his rams. The Feast of Idul Adha, otherwise the Feast of Sacrifice, is celebrated by millions of Muslims across the globe. It is in commemoration of Prophet Ibrahim's willingness to sacrifice his son Ismail, a gesture that was eventually honored by providing a lamb instead. The slaughtering and sharing meat from a ram during Toboski is thus considered symbolic. Louis Mendy, GRTS.